can talk to an individual and remind and help them to bring out what was deep in their head lock away somewhere you know you have to unlock that mystery box in order to see we can't start realizing that we need each other when we start losing each other we need to realize that when we have each other and we have each other now so we have to make each moment count we have to make each other happy you know you have to kind of do what everybody else is doing but kind of set yourself apart that when you want to be the boss you are the boss so it's good baby so you continue to take this positive practical um learning thing you know to the family first and we don't want the type of wealth that comes with bloodshed or underhand we want the type of wealth that comes with with, with with blood sweat and tears yes that pull us all together as a family I love where I'm at in life because I love myself. And loving yourself is not a bad thing. Loving yourself allows you to learn who you are actually as a human being. God is there. And once God is on his side, and then him send him angels to look out for you, nothing can touch you. Even if you have to jump in the way and take you from this job that you're doing and fly you to another country. <laughs> God is on his side and that is how you know you're a good person who don't deserve anything bad in your life. You can do whatever you want. You can be as goofy as you want. You can be as powerful as you want. You can be as sad as you want. But that only will be a lot. Just a short span. Because you know, we want to keep the energy up. The opportunities are endless. I don't know. I just feel like I have a lot to share in my own little way. And that is what I like to do. I like to do things in my own little way. I don't like to um trap myself in a box from when i was young i didn't i never liked to feel trapped like i can't explore what life is supposed to be offering me you know i just do me and i do what i feel like to do the world don't know what it is to be real nowadays like I, we're we're so lost and our eyes are so blind to what reality really is but one at a time, we're slowly coming out and we're seeing the truth of what life really is. It's just for you to open your ears and listen. Once his wise words to let you grow spiritually, Bob Marley, Tupac. Yo, those people are beyond wise. All you need is silence. All you need to do is take away yourself sometime. Take away yourself. Hey, take away yourself. <laughs> If I'm angry, I won't be angry for long. If I'm stressed, I won't be stressed for long. If I'm um, anything negative, it won't be for long because life is for living and life is for fun. And I hope what I said today can touch your life in some way. And I'm not being preachy because I'm not a pastor. <laughs> I'm just Kimmy and I'm just Kimmy being real. Look at life, man. You go through all these things and you're like, oh my gosh, it's the end of it all. La, 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 la. And then, when you give it a chance, you see how it blossoms into something else, but you have to give it a chance. So anybody who is suicidal today, just wait and give it a chance. You see all those people who are bullied? Just wait and give it a chance because the same thing that you are being bullied for, it's the same thing that's going to make you stand out and be your talent or your gift. And then once you use it, oh, follow the path of God and you're good. I don't, I don't believe in forgive and forget. I believe in forgive and learn and move forward. You just drop whatever negativity that you carry in your heart for somebody else, which is a huger burden than you think. And once you drop it, you can move forward freely. Yes. Mm -hmm. I like it. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> the rain is gone. I can see all obstacles that were in my way disappearing behind me. You know, it's gonna be a bright.